how to install google tag manager on shopify hi guys welcome back to another video and in today's video i'm going to be telling you how you can install a tag manager on your shopify store so having said that let's just jump into the video so first things first what you want to do is you want to come over here onto your shopify store uh the quick and easiest way is to go ahead and click on the app store and go to all apps right go into all recommended apps open up the Shopify app store and here you want to search for Google tag manager or Google in general right find Google and this is the application right here click on install install the application while that does happen go to Google tag manager over here on this website you will see all of your tags so you can see I have a few over here but I'll go ahead and uh, delete these if I can't I'll just go ahead and click on create new right but before we do that we're gonna go ahead and install the application so that you know we can go ahead and convert it and add it and here it's gonna tell us go ahead and connect it to google account so we're gonna go ahead and click on connect google account select the google account and here we go all right so just wanted to set up google ad conversion looking for to set up google analytics for we can get started from there but here we have the google merchant center we can go ahead and connect it later but for now i think this looks good we'll go ahead and close this up all right but yeah you could go with that one uh or you can go ahead and set up your tag manager over here so let's go ahead and set up tag manager your company name is going to be over here what is the website name add that name add the country and then select your application right come container site if your container name is over here add the website over here uh, add the web address over here and then you are good to go after you've completed the account setup it's going to tell you to go ahead and install the google tag manager there are a couple of ways to do that either you go with this paste this code as high in the head section of your page as possible or paste this code immediately after after opening the body tag right or test your website over here you can go ahead and add the example right here this is going to be where you can go ahead and test it so let's go ahead and do this and copy and paste it to your website or go with the body option google tag manager let's go with this one all right this is tag let's go ahead and copy it come back over here go into online store go into themes go into click over here go into edit code go into theme.liquid we can see it right here this is the head section right uh this one is for the head this one is for the body let's go ahead and copy the head one first and check it out this is the head section place it right here click on save that should do it i'm gonna reload it just in case and now let's go ahead and paste the link and click on test all right it wasn't detected let me try again i have to complete it sometimes it takes a while but you should be good to go okay uh this is not detecting it but it should be there that's fine we can close it up and then what we want to do is we can see right here these are all our admin versions and stuff like that next you just simply want to click on submit all right click over here add the descriptive name so just add the name of the website if you want ad astra and a detailed description of the changes just added the tag i'll just add that and you should be good to go there you go uh it's done you can see right here five variables done and dusted Boom. live test is available right here your website and everything else so after that you can go ahead and check it out later you know on what is happening this is the container right here open it up you will see all of your modified all of your data over here and it is live as well so there you go that's how you do it that's how you add a google tag manager on your shopify store so thank you for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did be sure to hit the like button subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications and i will catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye